All right. Hi, I'm Henrik. Yeah. <laughs> Keep the English short and sweet. <laughs> What's this going to be like seeing Ryan Miller's number retired for the literally hundreds of games you played in front of the guy? Yeah, and uh, he's probably saved my ass more than anyone that uh, ever I ever played with. So I'm really excited for him. When you think of when you think of the honor for him, and you think of all the things he did in his career here. When you played with him at the time, did you get the sense that he was becoming that superstar kind of goalie and that icon of a franchise? Yeah, I think after the lockout year, uh, we had uh, Marty and uh, Mika, and then uh, we had I didn't know I, did, I haven't never seen Ryan before that, so when. Um, when he showed up and he got an opportunity to to play and uh, it was i mean he took the chance right away and he was uh, you know not <laughs> he was never going to look back i tell you that what made him so unique as a goaltender and as a teammate maybe i think he's just uh, he's very humble he's a great human being great guy to be around um, as you guys know and um just the calmness of him, seeing him prepare for games, preparing for practice. It was professional from, you know, from the day one. You know, you could actually learn from him, and I'm older than him. You know, yeah. that's, uh, that's remarkable. You know, you guys are all back celebrating for him. What's it like to be back together, you know, 15 years after you guys were that close? Um, I don't know if you can put words on it, but it's, you miss it. Definitely, you miss it. I don't miss hockey that much. I miss miss that part of it, you know, where you can be around the guys, and it's 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 fantastic. You were one of the guys who was injured. I asked Thomas the same thing. I mean, what, Oria, I think, on defense, and Conley was out. I mean, that was a team that actually had the opportunity. Do you, do you think about that a lot? Oh yeah. I mean, I, not a lot, but I, I think about it definitely. Uh, we had some uh, innocence of the team, like an innocent kind of a feeling. You know, we were, we, were, uh, we were not expected to be anything before the season, and then we performed well during the regular season, and everybody, yeah, yeah, but now it's the playoffs, and we, you know, showed we beat uh, uh, Philly in a tough series, and then we beat uh, uh, Ottawa. That was the number one team, and that was, now everybody started to feel it. Oh, we can do this, you know? Um, so, um, yeah, I mean, it's unfortunate. You got to have some luck too, to be able to win uh, win this uh, Stanley Cup. What was the was there a moment where that you really think back on on Ryan that really made define him a private moment or something that you can share during a game or something? Yeah, uh, Yuri Novotny is a a Czechia guy or a Czech Republic. I don't know. How they want to pronounce it nowadays, but uh, he was. Uh, we had a trade deadline 2006, 2007, and it was trade deadline. I think we had a game that day. Uh, so we getting undressed after pregame warm up, you know, in the mornings. He walks in the locker room and he said, "Like, uh, well, something happened. Something happened." And uh, Milsi goes, uh, "No." Uh, Giri, you've been uh, traded by a, uh, for a Gucci bag. <laughs> <laughs> he was very keen on, you know, big, you know, yeah. Gucci, <laughs> Louis, pr pr Prada, and all that. So that sums up Milsey. He's a great guy, you know. That's why we're here today to celebrate him as a gay, uh, as a as a guy, and as a uh, as a player. Because he's always remembered for being so intense, but he had those moments. Oh where, yeah. yeah, all the time. He drove, drove me nuts by, you know, listening to Hootie and Blowfish before every, uh, you know, home game in the locker room after, after the warm-up in the morning. Uh, Hootie and Blowfish. I, I still brings me back to this day when there is Rucker, when I hear him on the radio. It brings me back to the locker room with, uh, with Milsey. What are you doing now? Me? Yeah, what are you Nothing. <laughs> Just here talking with you guys. Yeah. No, I'm coaching a little bit of hockey. That's that's what I do. No, I'm in uh, New, Jersey. New Jersey. Yeah. They're trying to figure out my poor English as well. Just like you are. <laughs>
Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Thanks guys. Thank yeah. Good seeing you, man. Yeah, good to see you guys.